when it comes to ordering stuff from abroad, sometimes it can take quite a while to get to you. So, you know, you may see that as a bad thing if you're quite an impatient person. On the other hand, I suppose a kind of good thing is that if you're anything like me, you completely forget what it is that you've actually ordered. So you end up getting a big old bag of surprises. <laughs> so let's get into it. Hey guys, it's your girl Aisha Shasha and I feel like I haven't seen you like this in a hot minute. Hello. <laughs> Anyway, so I've got to say a massive thank you to Doll Blacks. I'd actually never heard of Doll Blacks before. And uh, they contacted me and they were like, girl. And I was like, girl. They were like, uh, we would love to send you some wigs so you can try them out for size and see how they look and see if you're liking them. And I'm like, honey, you had me at wig, okay? <laughs> you guys already know. I love me some wigs. So your girl has wigs. Now the only reason why this is slightly open is because I needed to make sure that it was from who it was from. Um, so I didn't want to do an unboxing video and I don't know, say the wrong company name or something. That's the only reason why it's open. I haven't actually looked inside at the wigs that are there. I only remember <laughs> one of the wigs that I ordered. I can't remember the rest. I don't know. Cause it was about maybe three weeks ago or something like that. To be honest, three hours ago is enough time for me to forget something. So pff, I don't know. <laughs> so I will leave a link in the description box below um, so that you can go ahead and check out their website and also get yourself a cheeky little discount because you know your girl always looks after you. Okay, so we are doing a wig try on video today. I'm gonna just dip my hand in and see what the first one is that we pull out. And it's the one that I remember. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, let's put this down. Okay. I'm excited. This is the one that I remembered. So I'm kind of um I'm kind of branching out a little bit. And you know, I'm starting to fuse blacks with, you know, pastels a little bit more. I don't know, starting to branch out. Maybe it's because, you know, autumn, winter is coming just changing it up a little bit. It is what it is. And I saw this black wig and I thought, you know what? That's got my colors in it. That's got my pinks, my purples and my blues. Those are my colors. Okay, you guys already know. Oh my goodness. And it's a short one as well. So this is something different for me, you know. I want I want it to to just try something new. Oh my god. Ah, get off. Get off. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Look at the colors on this. Oh wow. <gasps> oh my gosh, that's beautiful. Look at that. That is gorgeous. This cut, it reminds me a little bit of, um, well actually, not really. I was gonna say it reminds me a bit of Velma Kelly from Chicago, but her hair's a lot shorter than this. <laughs> But it just reminded me of it because it was, you know, a shortish black bob. I really like that. Okay, so let's have a little look at the inside. So wig cap has got some combs here in the side. We appreciate that. We do like some combs in the side. So got any in the back? No, just two in the side. It feels quite sturdy though, which is nice. I've actually never seen this wig before either. Um, so that's a good thing. I'm not really somebody who tries to make my wigs look natural. I know that I wear cosplay wigs and I really don't care, okay? So like, if you're kind of looking for, you know, a much more natural vibe with your wigs, I'm probably not really your girl because like I wear wigs of all different colors and I'm not trying to convince anybody that my hair is real because, you know, I can't be asked. <laughs> to be honest, like, I can't be bothered. It is what it is. It's a wig. Okay, so I'm excited to try this on though because this is going to look so different for me. Oh my gosh. Okay, so give me a second. Let me just get it on. Okay, so it has been a long time since I've done one of these. All right, so I haven't actually looked at this yet. I've just plonked it on. I will adjust it accordingly in just a second, but we are going to see how this looks for the first time together. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Bam. 
Okay, so we have some peakage going on here. Let me just adjust. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's pull that down. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I don't know why, but there's a little bit of, like, I don't know if it's just like air just here. So it's giving me a bit of a bump just there. Let me try and, let me try and pull it. Hold on. Flatten that down a bit. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is, I, I just love, I love this like hidden pink, purple and blue. I absolutely love that. Okay, I feel like I need to like tease this out and all sorts, but I can't find my teasing brush. Where's my teasing brush? Okay, so after much floofing around, and as I said, I couldn't find my teasing brush, so I just use a regular brush. This is the wrong brush for teasing. Um, so what, <laughs> i tell you what, I feel like, you know, um, in, in the film Hairspray, you know, the three black girls who are basically like the dream girls of the show. <laughs> and they always come on like sing their little songs. That's who I feel like, I feel like I'm one of them. <laughs> I feel like I'm about to start bursting into some Welcome to the 60s! Whoa, oh, 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 whoa. <laughs> I love it! It's very, very 60s. However, I do feel that this might look better on me if it was like dead straight. Do you know what I'm saying? Like if it was like really sort of dead straight. So I will, I will straighten this out at some point um, and I'll probably rock it in a different video and then you guys can see how that looks. But I absolutely love, 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 love this hidden flash of color here. I am all for this, all for this. I mean, you could even, let's say if you got like some hair bands and just like, like clipped the black away like that like you can make that look super super cute but then you'd actually be able to see like the pink purple and blue there are definitely different ways to rock this wig um but yeah if i was going to rock it like this i'd need to be dressed for the occasion like i i would happily rock a 60s hairstyle but i need to be wearing the right kind of clothes but i, I wanted this to be more of like my sort of kind of casual wig so i think what i will do is i will make it dead straight like I will steam it straight so that it's like proper straight. Um, and then yeah, have this as like my sort of casual wig. But this is cute, man. <laughs> I actually just happened to have this bow like right next to me. Now I don't have any clips to have. Oh wait, hang on, there's, there's, a, there's a bobby pin just there. Let me quickly stick this in. And this is just to see how it looks. Obviously it's not properly in. But you know what, that's cute because then this ties in with this, do you know what I mean? It automatically like draws your eyes to it. I made this bow myself, by the way. So like, if you guys want one, just holler at me. But um, yeah, that's really cute. That's really cute. If this was like properly teased out, so it was like out here, whoa. <laughs> but so it was like out here, like really big, like Tracy Turnblad style. I mean, this is cute. This is cute. Okay, this has got like 100% cuter for me. <laughs> Okay, we're keeping the bow on because it's a look. So let's dig into the next bag. Ooh. Did I order this? I forgot. <laughs> now, I know that I have quite a few pink and blue wigs. I know. But I didn't have a pale pink and blue wig that had a dark root. I didn't have that. So when I saw this, I was like, yes, please. <laughs> this is cute. Okay. God knows where they're gonna go on my wig wall because my wig wall is full, all right? So like, some girls are just gonna have to go. <laughs> oh my goodness. So this is a split wig, but because of the dark root, it's a lot more subtle. Look at that, oh my gosh. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Now it's not like a black root. It's a sort of like brown, brownish kind of color. 
Um, let's have a look at the inside. Do we have any combs? Okay, no combs on this one. It's just a normal standard standard um, wig, wig, um, can't talk tonight. Normal standard wig cap. <laughs> But this is beautiful. I love, love this wave pattern. This here is my favorite kind of wave pattern, this sort of body wave. This is me, okay? I love this. This is absolutely stunning. Oh my God. Tangle free as well, as you can see. That's beautiful. Okay, let's get her on. Three, two, one, bam! Ba -ba 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 -ba. <laughs> I need to fix this. I need to stop doing this, you know, because I look ridiculous when I come up. <laughs> All right, hold on, give me a second. Okay, so now that she is all like brushed out, um, can we just, <laughs> I mean, come on. Oh my goodness. I love this. I really, really, really do love this. This is cute. It's so, so and it matches my top as well. It matches my t-shirt. It's just so, it's so, so soft, like in color. It's soft in texture as well, but like the color. That is so, so soft. That's beautiful. This is a nice sort of wintry one, I think. This would be perfect for the winter time. This is gorgeous. I love it. I really, really do love it. I would actually tease it out a tad more when I can find my teasing brush um, and, you know, whack a nice bow on it. Or if I was doing a more wintry kind of look, probably like a nice beret. Oh my gosh. You can imagine me in like a sort of cozy jumper, beret, this hair. This would look really cute. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely feeling this. This is adorable. Make sure that you're taking note as well because I do want to know what your favorite wig is at the end of this video. So let's dig deep. Let's find wig number three. Oh, I forgot I got this. Oh my God. Okay, so I got something that's like completely out of the ordinary for me. Oh my God. I completely forgot that I got this. Oh my God. This is gonna look ridiculous with this t-shirt on, but you know, we're just, we're just gonna have to roll with it. We're just gonna have to imagine that I'm in some really flamboyant outfit, you know. <laughs> it's something that's just so different. And like, I remember looking at it actually and thinking, gosh, could I pull that off? Me, really? I mean, I know that I can pull off most wigs, but this one, can I pull it off? So I thought I'll never know unless I actually try. I don't know if you're ready. I don't know if I'm ready. Oh my goodness. Look at the curls on that. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is a white, or it's, it's kind of more of a sort of off-white. I forgot it's got pink in it. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is a sort of like off-white with hints of pink. Can you see? It's really hard to actually show you this on camera. Can you see, there we go. There, can you see those sort of hints of pink in there? But the bounce though, oh my gosh. I feel like I'm about to be part of like a period drama or something with this one. This is stunning. Oh my goodness. But I feel like I have to be properly dressed for this. Like I need to be in like, like a ball gown or something. Do you know what I mean? But this is just beautiful. I really, really like this one. But can I pull it off though? Can I pull it off? Oh my goodness. I feel like I need to like, do a sort of like styling video with these wigs. <laughs> Just so that I can see like how I actually style them. Right, and the inside, we've actually got three combs in this one. Per, 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 per. We have three combs, two there and one at the back. Brilliant. To keep this bad boy in. I'm just loving these curls. I think that they're fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Okay, let's get her on. Okay, I have absolutely no idea how this is going to look on me. It might look ridiculous to begin with. Please bear with me. <laughs> okay, in three, two, <laughs> one. Bam! <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> okay, so I didn't actually clip it in because I knew I was going to have to like maneuver it somehow. So let me just, hold on, if I just, Ah, there we go. Pop that clip in there. And then 
yeah there we are pop you there and then what I would need to do is I would need to really beef that up okay give me a minute Okay, the thing that I find with most wigs is that like, I need a couple of seconds to get used to it. Um, this took me about maybe 10 minutes <laughs> to get used to, but, and I know that there's a lot of whites going on. So, you know, it might be a bit difficult to see. I did completely forget that I ordered a white curly wig. I completely forgot that. Um, Otherwise I'd have had a different background color, so my apologies. Um, but I feel that with my sparkly white bow, like this actually kind of comes together. Like ignore the t-shirt, okay? Cause this doesn't go, ignore that. So let me just get down to here. But I do feel like some sort of like, you know, fairy, fairy princess kind of vibe. Do you know what I'm saying? Now, my, my issue with it is here. Can you see there is a lot of like gappage here that I have to sort of cover up and the bow does that. But you know what else does it? Glitter! <laughs> we work with what we have, honey, okay? And give myself a glitter parting. Fabulous. Nobody needs to know that there are any gaps in the hair. But yeah, that's just a little something that I think can be definitely worked on. Um, you know, we don't we don't need to have to have gaps in our hair. Um, but I can get around that with glitter. I throw glitter on everything. Okay, <laughs> put glitter on everything, and everything will be fine. All right. I just happen to have like this purple glitter here. I probably would have used a different color, really. But you know, it does the job. It does the job. It's nice and it's sparkly. And nobody needs to know that there are any gaps in the roots. <laughs> but yeah, so that that's that's my my one issue with it is the um little bit of gapping there. It's an incredibly hard front uh wig as well, but I knew that when I ordered it because this isn't like, you know, a normal sort of day-to-day -day wig. This is very much a cosplay kind of wig, so I wasn't expecting for it to be like a lace or anything like that. Um, so I knew exactly what I was getting into when I ordered it. I just completely forgot that I ordered it. <laughs> but I don't really care about stuff like that. You know, that you, you already know me. I don't care about hard fronts or whatever. This is cute. Like the more I look at it, the more I'm like, you know what, I'm actually really loving it. <laughs> like, it just took me a long time to get used to. Um, again, different ways that you can wear this. I'm sure that you can, you know, you can like bunch it up. You could even dress it up in a really sort of like, you know, period drama sort of style i don't really know how to do those beautiful hairstyles i don't know how to do that but you know you could do if you were more skilled you could do that um yeah there's lots of different ways that you can you can put this sort of you know big poodle hair together but i think it's really cute <laughs> would you wear something like this because <laughs> i would in the right place i would <laughs> okay so wig number four there are five wigs by the way i don't know if we're, i don't know whether i mentioned that in the beginning but there are five wigs so wig number four is ooh, how does this oh it's a pigtail one brilliant okay 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 i do love me a pigtail wig okay i do already have a pink pigtail wig but it's a very different style and it's a different shade of pink Ooh, okay, so these pigtails are a lot thinner than what I'm used to. There we go. I'm used to like the sort of like big chonky ones. These ones are thinner and cuter and evidently lighter. Oh, how cute is that? That is adorable. I like the gradient on this though. That's a beautiful gradient there. Can you see that? 
that light going into the slightly darker pink that's beautiful okay so yeah she's got one of the uh, smaller claw clips on there and the actual wig itself let's have a look i can't remember whether it was a short wig or if it was a long one i don't i don't remember so we'll have to see ah it's a short one. Ooh, okay okay we have a short pink bob oh my gosh i've never worn one so short oh my gosh and then you just clip those onto the sides right let's try this on it's gonna look so different from this <laughs> okay here we go in three two one bam <laughs> i forgot to tell you that this one does have um combs in the side E or either side, I can't talk properly, in either side. It doesn't have any in the back, it's just got one on each side. Oh my goodness. Okay, oh, I do, I like this kind of cut. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I look so different with like super short, like, or the super, super short wig on, I look so different. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, so let's put the pigtails on. Let's clip these in. Ah! Everything is better with pigtails. <laughs> oh my God, that's so cute. <laughs> that is cute. That is super duper cute. What do you guys think? I think it's adorable. I'm so used to having like so much more hair and then like the big pigtails on the top. But this is very light and airy and refreshing. <laughs> this is gonna take some getting used to, like having it so, so short. Oh my gosh. That's definitely gonna take some getting used to, but it's fairly cute. I think I need bigger earrings though. Like my cute little love heart earrings are not cutting it. I think I need bigger earrings with this. <laughs> But this is still adorable. I look like a little anime girl. <laughs> Last but not least, ugh. I don't know what it is. So I've forgotten. So I forgot I ordered a blue one. Oh my gosh. Now, was this one short? No, I think this one might have been like a mid length one. Ooh, child. This really feels like Christmas because. I, can, I know I keep saying it, but it's because it's true. I genuinely forgot what I ordered. I only remembered the black one and that was it. The rest, gone out of my brain. Completely forgot what they were. Okay, so it's longer than I thought it was. <laughs> but look at this blue. I love this sort of like really, really deep navy blue. That looks so cool. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm excited. I am excited to try this on. I'm gonna look so different. Oh my gosh. But get off. I didn't even remember that it had this kind of like cobalt blue underneath it. Oh my gosh. No combs in this one as far as I can see. No, but still very nicely constructed cap. We're happy with that. The thing is, is that when I was getting dressed today, I didn't even know what to put on because I couldn't remember what I'd ordered. So I didn't know what was going to go with what. So I thought, okay, I'll just be safe. I'll just put on something pastel and everything will be fine. This is not gonna go with this outfit in the slightest, but hey ho, <laughs> here we go. In three, two, one, bam. Oh, I can't see. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh man, I love this color. This sort of really deep navy, I love this color. Hang on, wait, my bangs are on the wrong side, hold on. Let's sort that. Let me flick that over that side. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. I love, love this color. Oh my days. I never wear this sort of blue. I, I think I might have like maybe two things in this blue. But this navy, I love that. I absolutely love that. Oh my gosh. Ah. Oh my gosh. I will keep saying it, but like, I love the navy. I really, really do. I feel fierce. <laughs> this is really nice. 
I think we've ended on a good one. I really, really like this one. I really do. You can obviously have the bangs full if you want to. You just have to kind of like adjust it so that you can actually see. And of course you can clip them as well. Or you can kind of like, like style them in a cool anime-esque sort of way. There we go. Something like that, something really cool and edgy. <laughs> This has got to also be like the flattest hair because like, you know, I don't normally do like straight, straight, straight hair, but I like it. I do like it. That's awesome. Sorry, I keep looking at myself. I'm really sorry. <laughs> this could be a casual one for me as well, to be honest. <laughs> so there you are, my darlings. I thought that I would go for a huge variety of wigs try out some stuff that I've never tried out before. You know, there's a couple of things there that I'm familiar with, but there's a couple that I really wasn't familiar with. And you know, sometimes you don't know what's gonna suit you unless you push yourself out of your comfort zone. So, you know, like there are a couple there that I'm a little bit like, okay, I know that I need to work with these in a very particular way to make them work. Um, and then there are some that I can just chuck on and be like, do you know what? I feel fabulous in this anyway. And I don't need to do anything else to it because I love it. <laughs> So if you'd like to check out the uh, Doll Blacks store, then feel free to. The links are in the description box below. So you can check out all the wigs that I wore today and ob obviously go ahead and shop to your heart's content. I'll leave a discount code in there as well for you so you can save yourself a pretty penny when you do so. I hope that you enjoyed this video. This for me was quite a lot of fun. Pushing some boundaries. <laughs> And yeah, I do, I do definitely want to, um, you know, showcase these wigs again, but with me dressed more appropriately for each one. But as I said, I forgot what I ordered. <laughs> So anyway, if you did enjoy this video, then please feel free to subscribe so that you don't miss the next one. Take care, my darlings, and I'll see you all soon. Mwah. Bye.